An entitled Karen breaks open the doors of an ambulance and prevents a patient from getting life-threatening care for such an unimportant, non-life-threatening reason. It doesn't end well for her. Here's what happened. So, this just happened last night, and I still can't believe someone would do this. I'm a 30-year-old paramedic, and I've been in EMS for the past eight years, and I absolutely love my job. Last night, we were dispatched to a 75-year-old female who fell at home. The patient stated that she tripped over her carpet and hit her head when she fell. We arrived on the scene and noticed that the home was a duplex, with our patient's door on the right and her neighbor's door on the left. We made our way into the home and found her lying on the floor. The woman was awake and breathing. We started asking her the standard questions. Are you okay? Does anything hurt? Do you remember the fall? Etc. She stated that she has a pounding headache and that she remembers walking to bed and then waking up on the floor. In my field, that's a pretty big red flag. We noticed that she's got a pretty good lump on the side of her head and a big bruise starting to form already. 